Hello, everybody. I have been thinking. You know, um, newspapers, how they used to be big, you know, daily newspapers. Um, around New Hampshire, it's the Union Leader, and I'm sure you have your own uh, paper where you live. Um, and you probably also noticed that they are going the way of, a, of the dodo. Well, here is an idea to help um, keep them around. That is, if they do listen to this video, or watch this video, and are able to implement what I suggest. Why not use MP3s? You know, um, since the printed paper is pretty much dead, um, you can probably save a whole lot of money, just cancel the, uh, you know, finish the subscriptions and end up canceling all those and you'll save a whole lot of money because you wouldn't have to buy paper or ink. Um, you would have to put that money into broadband, but you would still charge. And in an MP3 file, you can still have advertisement in the MP3 file. Um, you know, like maybe after a story or in between stories. And you could even have a couple MP3 files, you know, like maybe one that's uh, a major, major stories and um, one that are other stories. Um, but yeah, you could probably have one or two um, MP3 files, uh, two to three hours long. And I, I would definitely, uh, or maybe even sooner, that would be the model that I'd pay for. As long as the MP3s did not have any DRM, because you want to make it, you want to be able so people could um, uh, uh, give them around. And now you're saying, well, you know, if people give them around, they won't be going through us to pay for these. Well, you can't have that mindset in this digital age. You know, because like it or not, that content is not yours. You only you only get paid for it for a little while. And then it just goes out there, and most of the time it just uh, uh, ends up lining the cat box. Um, you know, so that's that's the reality of news. But what that would do is, um, you know, maybe a small group of people would, you know. Uh, share them, but the majority of people, I would think, would buy the uh, subscription um, to the MP3 service and listen to them because they'd want to support your paper, because your paper is local. If your local paper goes away, then what will people do for their news? Um, go to the internet, maybe. <laughs> but anyways, it just uh, it's just a thought that I was thinking about, which I think could work. Any comments? Talk to you later. Ciao.